Take a look at this beautiful 2022 Ford Expedition Limited Stealth in the high package. This one is in dark matter metallic, this amazing gray color and has all kinds of upgrades. Let's check it out. So the first big upgrade is under the hood in the high stealth package in the limited series. You do get the high output twin turbo 3.5 liter EcoBoost engine made it to a 10 speed transmission. This thing will move because it is the stealth package. You'll notice you've got all kinds of black accents all over the vehicle and then you have these gorgeous led headlights up front which are fully automatic set it and forget it including auto high beam led fog lights to go with that front sensors in the bumper let you know if you get too close to your kid's bike in the garage front tow hooks help you pull out the chevy that's in the ditch and then you've got your front camera it's mounted in that grill, uh, letting you know if you get too close to a shopping cart or a curb, you can just take a look at that camera system. The vehicle also does have a forward collision system with pedestrian detection. That means if somebody comes out in front of the vehicle, you don't see them in time, it'll stop for you. That saves lives and saves you some money on insurance. You can see this nice little sensor by the wheel there. That is for the active park. This vehicle can actually park itself. That's great for a great big beauty like this one. Then you see these stealth wheels that look so good on the side. Um, these wheels definitely have that nice blacked out aluminum alloy finish. They are a 22 inch wheel with grabber rubber on the outside. Then you have these black capped mirrors that have a signal light in them. They've got a camera underneath them for all around camera parking. This is a heated power mirror. It's memory, it's auto folding, and it has a blind spot system in it. So that lights up when somebody's in your blind spot. To get in or out of this vehicle, you can just put the code in here and it'll unlock, or you can put your hand inside the door handle, it'll sense the heat from your hand and unlock with the heat from your hand. If you press this button right here, it will lock it up, which is nice. Uh, you can also use this key fob right here, which has unlock, lock, remote start, as well as a uh, power for lift gate and alarm, or you can download the Ford Pass app and do that anywhere in the world from your cell phone for free. Thank you, Ford. Uh, you can see nice tinted windows off the back that look great and then if we open up these back doors you might have noticed these power running boards come out to greet us which is so great and then the stealth interior has the nice red accent stitching You've got red accent stitching on these chairs. These are the captain's chairs, not the optional bench that you can get. Has all weather matting upgraded in here. In the back, the rear seats are heated. You have rear climate control, rear USB, and rear inverted power supply. And then take a look up top and you have this huge panoramic sunroof with power shade, letting in all kinds of natural light. That is awesome. As we come to the back of the vehicle, you've got more park sensors for up you see that blacked out limited badging there you see the expedition blacked out there and then you do have a trailer tow package it's just underneath right here that plastic garnish now both the glass and the hatch can open up but if we hit this button on our key fob that is going to open that you see these beautiful new led tail lights as well it looked great and then in the back just so much space this has been upfitted with a cargo liner that can cover the third row and the back portion those back seats do come up and you actually have multiple ways to bring those up you can bring them up from two buttons here, two buttons there. You also have USB on this side and cup holders, another USB and more cup holders there. You have a subwoofer here. This does have the upgraded 22 speaker unleashed Bang & Olufsen system. And then you can actually put your seats up and down from here. And even that middle row you can put down from here. And then just take a look at that interior. That looks amazing. You can also see that huge screen up front that because this one has been upgraded with the 15.5 inch touch screen system. Let's go up front and check out some of those features. So I'm just gonna open up the driver's door. I always like to show these stickers here. So this is the capacities for the vehicle as it is configured. So you can see those. And then you'll see we do have our power window or our memory setting right here, power locks, power windows. I uh, just had some windows tinted up front on this one. So we're not gonna roll those down right now. And our power folding mirrors. Another one of those Bang & Olufsen stereo speakers. Again, 22 of those. Uh, nice little Easter egg touch on the inside when you open this up. Uh, just has this kind of stenciled out in there. So it's got shows you can do city and country living if you like. Um, more red accent in here. And then look at this, the trim that has been done in here I'll show you more inside but that is really nice we've got uh, the ability to put our headrest down in our third row for visibility with that button power lift gate those set it and forget it headlights with your fog lights here interior dimmer switches emergency brake power adjustable pedals power tilt and telescopic steering 
Uh, our seats are a 10-way adjustable heated and cooled seat. Super comfortable. Let's climb inside. All right, now that we're inside here, we are going to hit the push button start. That's gonna fire this up. Look at that new digital display. That looks awesome and it gives you all kinds of information. Whatever you want, you can actually put up different menus. Right now I just have the uh, tack up as well as the digital speedometer in a calm screen. Um, this also has uh, speed sign detection, so it'll display the speed sign as you go past it. On the steering wheel and the stealth, look at this nice uh, detail for the finishing then on here you have adaptive cruise control so to slow you down with the vehicle in front of you has lane departure system as well as self-drive known as say a lane centering so it'll actually steer the steering wheel for you using the lines on the road to keep you in the middle volume control so your stereo voice recognition system uh, on the stealth this is not blue this is a blacked out badge there and then on this side, you've got controls to that menu up top and controls for your phone and then just uh, tr toggling between your music. Now, this leather steering wheel is heated. Feels like a warm cup of coffee first thing in the morning. Really nice. Uh, up top here, you've got a huge center channel speaker. Again, Bang & Olsen. Place to put things. And then this giant 15.5-inch screen. And it does all kinds of stuff in here. We can press this button to the menu. You can go into all kinds of things. Like you can go into a sketch and you can actually draw on this it does have apple carplay and android auto and that can wirelessly go to this with the new sync 4 so this can become your uh, phone your apps on your phone you know everything from your maps your spotify your apps uh you know like anything you want which is great navigation if we hit that has a hard base navigation system in here you can actually blow that map up to be just about the whole screen and that is huge it's also a connective navigation system so it actually uh, has real-time feedback with forward for traffic and all kinds of information and you've got some hot keys down here for our phone and media devices and then we have some climate controls down here we can control the rear the front uh, if we want to go into our heated or air-conditioned seats just a slider there heated steering wheels just touch of a button and fan controls and then they've got a nice volume knob here kind of a neat thing they've done if you want to go into some menus you press the vehicle icon bring you into menus so we can set up for towing self park valet mode and then if you want to see all around the vehicle you've got the camera system which is just awesome you can actually go into a whole bunch of different views in here and see different views for camera so we can see backup we can see front we can do a triple view or if we're hooking up to the hitch we can see right behind us like that so really nice and easy as we come down here, four-way flashers, traction control, and just a quick button for quick defrost, defrost max, if you need to do that in cold, cold weather. And look again at just the trim that's on here. I love the graphics on that. Open this up. You have a wireless charger, USB and USB-C controls. Open this one up. You've got your cup holders. Then we have a rotary style shifter for that 10 speed. And we do have an M button. M is for manual. And then we can shift up and down through 10 gears using this. So this has a locking rear differential. So into some really low traction you can lock that up we've got two high four low four high and four automatic so four different ways to put the four by four or two wheel drive in the four automatics my favorite just set it and forget it drive modes what are those well if we turn this dial you are going to see we can go from normal to eco to sport to tow and then if we go the other direction we can go into slippery sand and mud and ruts uh, so those are the different modes you can put for engine or for traction control. Uh, I have to be honest, I think my favorite mode is the sport mode. When we put it on there, you see the graphics. It's going to shift me into uh, all-wheel drive setting, and then it's got kind of like a race, race red setting there. As we come down here, you'll see we've got um, hill descent controls. If you're going on a steep hill, you can press this. It'll keep you from free rolling. And then this is your self-park. So you can get there from the menu on the screen, or you can just hit this quick hard button. It'll take you there. Big center console open that up upper and lower section with a 12 volt inside uh, and then you come up top you have an electrochromatic auto dimming mirror we've got some map lights controls for our power sunroof and power shade speaking of shades you put your sunglasses in here and then you do have garage door openers up here as well so that is the beautiful all new 2022 uh, Ford Expedition in a limited high stealth package with the upgraded 15.5 inch screen. Thanks a lot for taking a look at this video, you guys. If you like to give a big thumbs up. If you like this channel, go ahead and hit subscribe. And if you want, hit that bell icon. You'll be notified every time I make a video. Thanks and have a great day.